Greetings and peace. I hope you and yours are doing well today, wherever you might be watching this from. Now the title of today is My Message to Americans. Enjoy your life and stop working yourself to death. Every day when you open up the newspaper, you go onto the back of the area and you'll see the sheriff's sale. And in the sheriff's sale, you'll see so many old couples that couldn't maintain the taxes anymore, they couldn't maintain the home anymore, and their home is gone. You spend your whole life working yourself to death, paying taxes, and even if you might have a paid off home, if you don't pay the local municipality their taxes, they'll come and take it from you. When you want something fixed in your home, you have to get a permit from the local municipality to even fix something on your home. So why are you spending all your life just working yourself to death over a system where you don't even own anything? And even if you do have that aspect, but still, you have eminent domain, you have gentrification, you have so many things that come in play, where if you don't pay these extortion fees every year to a system that's not given back to you in any way also because of its um, domestic policies and foreign policies, There's so many homeless people out here, schools are underfunded, social programs for the youths, so your taxpayer money is not being used to help the people anyway. So enjoy your life. Maintain a good balance in your life. And don't just spend your time working, 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 because each day and each breath you draw, your life is getting shorter and shorter with the symbolism of the hourglass. And you're not going to take any of this stuff with you except the good that you did for yourself and others. That's the only wealth that you will accomplish in this life that has any meaning in this life and the next. So stop working yourself to death in a system that's not there to benefit you, that you don't own anything in the end. Even a car, if you don't have that for official use sticker only from the state, they, and anybody from the local authority can pull you over and take your car. You don't pay the taxes even though you spent your whole life paying off a home. It'll, it'll get taken from you, just like how you see the sheriff's sale for older couples who have passed away. And that's... Um, you know, it makes me feel some type of way when I see those things. And it shows you that just maintain a good balance. Have a good balance in your life. Focus on your health. Focus on your well-being mentally, physically, emotionally, spiritually. And enjoy your life. Yes, there are the responsibilities of life. You have to work, pay bills, etc. But this system is not designed to give you any break. So you create your own break. Whether it's a weekend or two weeks out of, you, of a year you go somewhere, but maintain that break and don't let the system work you to death. And just enjoy your life, because there, there's nothing else more to this life than this. And think about it from a spiritual point of view. Were you just sent here to pay bills, pay taxes, and die? This is a spiritual school, this realm that you're in. You were sent here to learn something, and that's it. Upliftment of the human heart, each other, yourself. You were sent here to learn something, and after that, you depart from here, in the grave, with nothing. Not your home, not your car, not your titles, your accolades. Except what good did you do for yourself and others. That is the supreme reality of understanding. I hope you were able to get something out of my message. And I ho hope the rest of this winter, February 22, 2022, goes great for you. I wish well for you and yours. Thank you.